This video explains how to replace a broken shear pin on a DBS drive unit equipped with an electromechanical primary reducer. Shear pins are provided for all DBS electromechanical reducers, including E-type, L-type, and W-type, and they are used to protect the drive unit. If the drive experiences torque levels greater than the rated value, the shear pin is designed to break, preventing further damage to the rest of the unit. If this occurs, the shear pin will need to be replaced before the drive unit can be operated. For this procedure, you will need a flathead screwdriver, snap ring pliers, a small punch, a hammer, and a spare shear pin. Spare shear pins are located inside the torque gauge box. Please contact the factory if additional shear pins are needed. Before working on any equipment, ensure the power source is fully disconnected. Always wear proper PPE in accordance with local laws and regulations. First, use the flathead screwdriver to remove the rain cover located on top of the helical gearbox. With the snap ring pliers, slide the ring holding the shear pin in place out of the groove. Take extra care when removing the snap ring as it may snap off of the pliers, becoming a projectile hazard. Before removing the broken shear pin, you may need to use the flathead screwdriver to turn the inner shaft until the punch marks line up. Then, gently tap out the broken shear pin using the hammer and punch. Insert the spare shear pin, but do not force it. If it does not go in smoothly, you may need to adjust the inner shaft alignment before inserting the shear pin. Slide the snap ring back into the groove to secure the shear pin. The screwdriver can be used to gently tap the ring into place. Once you have successfully replaced the shear pin, be sure to reinstall the rain cover. More information on our products can be found at dbsmfg.com. If you have any additional questions, you can email our engineering team at engineer at dbsmfg.com or call 404-768-2131.